Hi students now we are going to discuss about the next topic in the same lesson plastids plastids are double membrane bound organelles found in plants and some algae there are three types of plastids chloroplast chromoplast and leucoplast chloroplast green colored plastids are present chromoplast yellow red orange colored plastids are present leucoplast colorless plastids next topic photosynthesis photosynthesis photo means light synthesis means to build in this process carbon dioxide combines with water in the presence of sunlight and chlorophyll to form carbohydrates during this process oxygen is released as a by product so green plants are called autotrophs photosynthesis occurs in green parts of the plant such as leaves stems and floral buds photosynthetic pigments are of two classes namely the primary pigment and accessory pigments chlorophyll a is the primary pigment other pigments such as chlorophyll b and carotenoids are called accessory pigment the process of photosynthesis takes place inside the chloroplast there are two stages in the photosynthesis first stage light dependent photosynthesis second stage light independent photosynthesis light dependent photosynthesis or hill reaction this was discovered by robin hill this reaction takes place in the presence of grana of the chloroplast photosynthetic pigments absorb the light energy and convert it into chemical energy atp and nadph2 the full form of atp adenosine triphosphate the full form of nadph2 nicotinamide adenine dinucleotide hydrogen phosphate these products of light reaction move out from the grana to the stroma of the chloroplast light independent reaction this is also called dark reaction this is carried out in the stroma of the chloroplast during this reaction carbon dioxide is reduced into carbohydrates with the help of light generated atp and nadph2 this is also called as calvin cycle and is carried out in the absence of light next topic mitochondria the mitochondria are filamentous or granular cytoplasmic organelle present in cells mitochondria is the main organelle of cell respiration they produce a large number of atp molecules so they are called as power houses of the cell or atp factory of the cell respiration respiration involves exchange of gases between the organism and the external environment there are two types of respiration aerobic respiration and anaerobic respiration first one aerobic respiration aerobic respiration is the type of cellular respiration in which organic food is completely oxidized with the help of oxygen into carbon dioxide water and energy 
stages of aerobic respiration glycolysis krebs cycle electron transport chain glycolysis it is a breakdown of one molecule of glucose into two molecules of pyruvic acid glycolysis takes place in cytoplasm of the cell krebs cycle this cycle occurs in mitochondria matrix at the end of the glycolysis two molecules of pyruvic acid enter into mitochondria the oxidation of pyruvic acid into carbon dioxide and water takes place through this cycle electron transport chain it occurs in the inner membrane of the mitochondria NADH2 and FADH2 molecules formed during glycolysis and krebs cycle are oxidized to nad plus and fad plus to release energy via electrons the electrons move through the system release energy which is trapped by adp to synthesis atp this is called oxidative phosphorylation in this process for oxygen the ultimate acceptor of electrons gets reduced to water next anaerobic respiration anaerobic respiration takes place without oxygen in this process glucose is converted into ethanol respiratory quotient the respiratory quotient is the ratio of volume of carbon dioxide liberated and the volume of oxygen consumed during respiration it is expressed as respiratory quotient equal to volume of carbon dioxide liberated by volume of oxygen consumed